Because this Sunday, Columbus, Ohio, it's all about... The money. It's all about the money. This is Canadian money, you know. Canadians are going to figure it out by now. I like to incorporate the theme song for the pay-per-view, but Money in the Bank every year has the same generic theme song, because I think it's simple. Otherwise, you got to keep going up and finding songs about money, and let's be honest, I don't think WWE wants or really has the time to do that. Um, but I'm not here to predict the Money in the Bank match right now. I'm going to do a series of videos, a set of videos, over the next little while. I'm probably create a couple of tonight, a couple then, do all the rest, boom, I just want to be done this in time so I can go... Watch Stanley Cup Finals Game 4. Let's go Lightning. Yeah. Um, let's talk first. The tag team title match. In one corner. Yeah, the prime tag players. The cha the challengers. You have the New Day. Probably represented by Xavier and Big E for obvious reasons. And this match really consists of a few things. Not the offensive, but everyone's black. You have teams that were in the Elimination Chamber, but then pay-per-view that really didn't live up to its name. I did the live reaction videos, deal with it. And I would have made more videos last week, but I got something called a j I have something called a job, so I try to make videos whenever I can. I'm like, yeah, let's do it. But no, this match is one that they've had a couple weeks to build. Primetime players did win a number one. It's not like they were handed number one contendership on a plate. No, this match, they were given it. Not giving it, excuse me. Instead of being given it, they earned it. And hey, you like to see that sometimes instead of someone just, okay, you guys versus you guys at this pay-per-view for these championships, go make magic happen. Um, I'm not expecting a whole lot out of this match. Why? Because tag team wrestling, then again, you sa I said that about payback with the two or three balls match. It was like, okay, whatever. And boom, it was the match of the night. It was up, it was, yeah, it was the match of the night for that pay-per-view. Let's be honest, Tag Team Wrestling has stolen the show at a few pay-per-views recently. Like, there was the R.A. match at uh, Extreme Rules, WrestleMania, the Fatal 4-Way, that was good, Fastlane. Every pay-per-view in 2015 has had a Tag Team match on it, whether it's well, pre-show, whether it's pay-per-view, pay or the network special. This Sunday's match, I'm not looking for, I'm not going into it with high expectations. I'm not saying it's going to suck, but I'm not going to say it's going to be, oh my god, that was incredible. Because we all know the last pay-per-view, Cena and Owens was the match of the night. But with everything being said, with everything being done, money in the bank, I am picking to win. I have in my hands right now. $20, but the new tag team champion, who I predict to win Sunday, will have millions of dollars, millions of dollars, millions of dollars. <laughs> Probably doing nothing fun. But, no, I predict the primetime players will win Sunday, because honestly, New Day as a stable, they should have gone with the Nation Domination uh, faction instead of the New Day, but hey, that's why they went, but I feel like a couple months ago, the title's for... Time to give them up. Have them be in an interesting feud with the primetime players over the next little while. And, and also, it would be nice to see all these new teams getting, people getting titles. Like, look, um, Seth Rollins, first ever uh, major championship in WWE. Uh, well, not saying major, but first, Seth Rollins is a champ. Uh, Ryback, who's never had a championship before. He's a champion right now. So, let's give it to the primetime players and have them do the millions of dollar dance with the tag team titles. Anyway, guys, I will see you when I see you next. But primetime players, over. New day. Sunday.